I, I fell into civil engineering completely by accident. I'd studied for a geography degree, but I really didn't know uh, what exact career path I actually wanted to follow once I'd finished that. But I found a graduate role within a transport planning team and I found straight away that I absolutely loved the chance to solve problems and to think creatively and to work in a team to get real visible things done. Challenges encountered by a civil engineer is that every project is unique. We have to handle different site constraints, site conditions and stakeholders. These challenges also bring me job satisfaction. I've been involved in projects for more than uh, 30 years in 30 different countries and across so many different sectors. I've met such interesting people. The opportunities to see different places and how things are done differently is really exciting. But at the heart of it all, I've met the most amazing people. We all do what we love to create places for people. Although my father told me that the construction industry is a man's world, I believe that one's determination and faith in yourself, any female could become a good engineer in the construction industry. So in fact, it's not just about what roles can women do, it's about what roles should women do. And the answer is we should absolutely aim to have a civil engineering community that reflects the communities, the reality of the world that is actually out there. I genuinely cannot think of a more exciting time to be a civil engineer than right now. There may be peaks and valleys in our career path. To truly push ourselves to great height, we must have confidence. And to achieve that, we must admit that it's never easy and we should embrace the inevitable challenges. For civil engineering, Technical knowledge is always a basic requirement. You ought to have a strong background. What I want to highlight here are the team spirit and communication skills. If you're curious, interested in solutions, fascinated by working together to create and inspire, then look no further. Also talk to people in the profession and look around you. Be inspired and believe in yourself. And remember, the best solutions are created by diversity of thinking and different viewpoints and voices are really important. And this equally applies to boys and girls. Gender is completely irrelevant. There is no difference in the career path of women engineers in Hong Kong or other cities as long as she is determined to devote her passion and strength to the construction industries. Remember, civil engineering isn't just about solving technical issues, but it's also about communication with your clients, your boss, your colleagues, and most importantly, the general public. <laughs>